Is it time to cue allergy season? I think so. Um, I pulled in the parking lot and all of a sudden I'm a sneezing. So anyways, I'm here at Hokey G's. Uh, just cruising. I was going over to Sheets to get gas and it's right next door. So I thought I'll just slip in here and see what the happenings are, if there's anything new. So let's go. First off, look at this basket. Oh my gosh. $32 bike basket. That is so cool. Oh my gosh. And tempting. But I love to look through junk boxes. Uh, there's some threads in here. $6. This one's four. Oh, and it has nothing. It says box full. No, this one's empty too. Well, this one is six. Again, that basket is so neat. I'm gonna look over here real quick, see what else they might have. <gasps> look at that bunny pick. Oh my gosh, the sticker fell off. He's a sparkly. I like him. Run dig. He's a dollar. If that's just fuzz, yep. I'm getting him for a buck. He just wants to swirl around and around. It's also this bag. Easter treat ornaments. Six dollars. That's pretty cool. I like the seed ornament. That's a clever idea. There is a tin full of spools for 12 And that's really all that's catching my attention here. This one is 12 Bunch of seam bindings. Oh, flat body doll, $10. This booth is full of puzzles. Does anyone else want to just start knocking them down and see if I can get a domino effect happening? It would be fun, but I won't do that. This has caught my attention. There's some birdhouses in it, but let's take them out and see what this is all about. It's three dollars. Ambiance. I like it though. I don't see anything wrong with it. I might grab that for three dollars. So I figure while I'm here in the $3 section, I may as well go ahead and look and see what else they got. I see some baggies. Home Co. Oh my gosh, there's a cute little boot in there. Mm. Some snowmen. What else they got? Those are cute. Oh, party candles. I think I still have some of mine that I bought <laughs> once upon a day. Uh, Hong Kong. Oh, and includes the candles. Bunch of salt sellers. A whole... Oh, wait. They're napkin rings. And they're plastic. Erase my last words. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. It's a Santa mug. $3, right? Yep. I'll be getting that. Some angels. I tell you what, those little Santa mugs, they make the cutest um, assemblages. More angels. And once again, my jeans are cutting off my circulation. I pulled these down to look at them. Six jumbo crayon candles. Oh my gosh. I I think I just need to get those because. And then I'm looking up here at uh, the cute little kitten. Ceramic. Oh my gosh. Uh, what else they got here that I really don't need, but I just really need in my life. I like that. That's three dollars. I like the handle on it. I don't know though. I don't want to get too crazy. I 
already loving the patriotic display here. Nothing here really that uh, is catching my eye. Oh, these are re really cool. Ten dollars. Little vases. Oh, no. Yeah. Pretty cool. Three dollars for the plastic bowl set. There she is in all her glory. Let's shake her up. Yeah. By the way, she is ten dollars. These little vases over here that are catching my attention. They're five dollars each. This by far is my favorite uh, case in Hokey G's. Look at that little planter up there. And if I read right, I think he's eight. If that's the case, I'll double check. I will definitely pick him up because, oh my gosh, what an arrangement I can make in that. And uh, this is 12. I've seen that somewhere else, the little boy with the bunny. Uh, they got a lot of bluebirds. That one is 40. Oh my gosh, look at that kitty cat. Nipper man. $36, mama cat. They got these bees. Condiment jars are 38 These are 18 Salt and pepper shakers. Uh, the uh, measuring cup set is 28 Wow, just some really cool stuff in here. They had the graduation kitties for 22 And the birds are 22 And these with the flowers on their head, 36 20 for the doggy on chains. Oh, so much cute stuff. So much. They do have some glass down here. 20 on that handkerchief face right there. I think it's 45 on that one. The green. The bowl is 42. I didn't even show you over here. The girl handle mug. She's 14. That's adorable. I don't know what you'd do with her, but uh, she's nice. $10 for the planter back there. The pink. And then the face pottery is 12 So, yeah. It's just fun things in here. Really fun things. Lots of head bases. Another case I love to look through. It's not locked. It's half off. And sometimes there's some really, really quirky things in this booth. So we're going to look today and hopefully we find some quirky things. Um, can you read that? $3. So it'd be $1.50. A couple postcards in there. I would love to find a St. Patrick's Day uh, postcard. I looked over the season and had no luck. I saw something very similar, but it, like, wished a happy Easter. I'm looking at this dude. He is uh, $5, so he'd be two fifty. The honeycomb bird. I really don't think I need him, but, you know, sometimes you just need things. Little tree up there, $4 in the bonsai. I don't know if that's lucite or just plastic. I could try to open up the case and... We'll figure it out. I don't know. It would be two dollars if I bought it. Is it worth getting? I'm gonna set it right there and look it up after I'm done thumbing through this cabinet. There's a St. Patrick's Day cup for three dollars. It'd be a dollar fifty. I guess I should have just flipped it over. Made in China. So let me get it back in here gingerly uh so yeah i think we're lucking out this this trip but that's okay it's still fun to look this booth looks like it's had a fresh restock done oh my gosh vintage tablecloth six dollars it's a happy birthday one prevent forest fires oh my gosh that is tempting would you get it i don't know see i'm like i want it but then I had to put this stuff somewhere for now, and, um, and it's like, is that overpaying for it? Things like that. I like the June Angel here. She is 18. She's got some fuzz. 
four dollars for the plastic Easter. Good looking salt and pepper shakers down here. Thirty-eight for the radio clock. They have some paper goods. Four dollars, two dollars. Uh, how much is the milk? Two dollars. So amazing, someone saved those toaster covers. I do remember these. Uh, my parents' neighbors. Um, <laughs> she had a toaster cover. They want ten dollars for it, and it might even look like that. But wait, there's a blender cover too that you can get. And it has butterflies on it. It too is ten dollars. There you go. Original price ninety eight cents. Inflation, I tell you. The little dish is six. The moon and stars. I really like this cupcake pan. It's ten dollars, but there is a discount of twenty percent off. I don't know. It'd be great to hold like uh, you know jump rings and um, pins and stuff like that when you're crafting just little bits of ephemera it's really tempting to get it beats like the regular cupcake pan you know 40 bucks for the art glass face wow it is long and it is thick now there's some smaller ones here 12.99 and then this one that one's 14.99 there toothpick holder 6.99 i wonder if that glows I like the toothpick holders, but then it's like you have only limited things you can do with them, like put toothpicks in them. And what else would you use a toothpick holder for? I would love to know. There's a lot of fun trinkets in this booth here. Uh, 19 dollars glass bowl. Oh, you know what? I wanted to look down here at these. They're coasters for seven. Cool looking. I see this great box, a cubby box. Ah, oh, my goodness. It's tempting. It is so tempting. I have a thing for boxes. It's always hard to say no to them when I see a good one. I don't much like the dividers, though. They're kind of cheapy looking. But the rest of it, and the metal handle, 26, huh? Well, something to think about. What are these? six dollars napkin rings oh my gosh those are very bohemian napkin looking rings um oh look at that <laughs> look at that lampshade uh there is a tag 26.99 very retro looking what else they got over here that can show you well i'm over talking the music of course 14 dollars earring holder for 3.99 350 for the little wicker calling it a purse but i'd say it's more of a basket isn't that adorable and it functions that's what's so nice about it lots of doilies 7.95 for the big doily 47.50 for a glass rooster lead crystal all right it's a hokey g's parking lot haul first off i spent 19 dollars and eight cents and i think you saw everything i got uh my little bunny sparkly bunny Ooh, he's losing his sugar i got this mainly this is out of that three dollar booth for the santa mug oh my gosh he's gonna make a very very cute arrangement my Crayola candles for three bucks not bad and then I did go back to that case there were so many things in there I wanted but I don't know I guess I just didn't need them however I did get the clown planter that is so corny looking. So cute. It is a Rubens. I paid $8. Oh my goodness. That's going to make a great arrangement as well. So I think I could even go tropical on that. I don't know. Alright, well I'll talk to you guys again soon. As always, thanks for coming along with me. Let me just say, I didn't think it was going to get this warm today. AC had to come on. 
anyways I'm at Goodwill I don't know the color tag this week I should know that by now but maybe sometimes I really just don't care and we're gonna go in and see what they got hopefully hopefully good things it is green color color tag of the week and this bowl is still here it's $15.99 so it would be eight dollars and I think I'm gonna grab it I'm trying to do a close inspection of it uh, but I like it I really do so that's going in the cart first thing first thing off the shelf Ooh, second of all, it's toasty in here. Let's see what else they have. Oh, isn't that a Chia Pet Elephant for $1.99? That's $3.99. $2.99, that's been here a while. It should be getting ready to go half off. These are two for $1.99. Hmm. They have a big doll house here. Mm-hmm. If that's your thing. Some uh fishing reels, two ninety nine, five ninety nine. I know nothing about those kind of things. Uh the roller skates are still here. Coffee trivet, three ninety nine. Dollar ninety nine. Are those ranunculas? And then over here, this one is a dollar ninety nine. Oh, someone cut it. Oh, Slippery Duck still here too. Hi there, Slippery Duck. He holds your meat for you. Look at this clothes hamper. It is in pretty poor shape though. It needs some sewing. It's three ninety nine. Oh my gosh, how adorable though. Grab bags are looking about the same as they were last time I was here. Look at these metal trays. The butterfly looks like a cat with a heart. There's blue and pink or peach, more peach. But oh my gosh, now they're not in the greatest shape. They're six bucks a piece. But my goodness, are those cute. Uh, I wish they just weren't so chippied up. That is so tempting to get six dollars. You know what, for $5.99 a piece, I think I'm going to grab them. I'm going to grab them both. I think I can get some of that smudge off of there. The decal is just as it is, but I still think they're just so cool. I saw the box. I opened it up. I'm just now looking at the price, $2.99, but look at this. You're fun to watch. <laughs> oh my gosh, but what I like most are the envelopes. Oh my goodness, they're vintage and they're crispy. And they're beautiful. And for $2.99, I may just grab it. So I put the paper back. I'm not going to get it. Half of the envelopes are missing. So I'm just going to leave it. But however, I am looking down here in this bottom bin. There are these Bicel wedding bells. $1.99. They're tempting to get. Um... Yeah, just not having much luck today. But I don't know if I should get those or not. Well, that was a very short trip to Goodwill. If I don't have enough footage, I'll combine it with Hokey G's because I went to Hokey G's first. And then I came here. And I spent a total of um, $23.27. So, I got some random things. These balloon sticks, they were $0.99. Cents. Got them for a craft project. The trays they were six a piece and I just couldn't leave them behind after I left that puppy tray behind it um or was it 13 pines I'm like I've been regretting it ever since I got this cute little heart for 99 cents and my green bowl so I had a clear bowl in my cart at one point that was in the, like the half price area but it had a really tiny like the tip had broken off I put it back and I got that for eight so that's it um, always though a good time to look and fun you know see what they have uh, just because sometimes there's some really good stuff so I'll leave it here I'll talk to you guys again soon